Happy Self Love Saturday, guys. Whoop, whoop. Oh, you guys can probably tell it's the holidays. I am home in Toronto. Whoop, whoop. Really excited to be spending some time with my family and be here. This is my grind time. This is like a, one of my favorite times of year because I'm just like on ideas mode and I love to plan out like all of my goals, all of my like move, 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 moves for the new year. And this is one of the first years that I can like recall that I started to put like serious wheels in motion from like October. Only thinking about the new year, like only thinking about January as if January was just another month in 2017. Like instead of just being like, well, when January 1st hits, like no, 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 I was like, boom, boom, boom. I gotta do this, I gotta do that, I gotta do this. So I actually feel really good going into 2018 because I've been putting the wheels in motion. I have holiday makeup. Hope you guys like it, hope you guys like it. Um, this is not the Fenty Beauty Red. This is my classic girl, Ruby Woo, because I won't lie, I have seen the Fenty Beauty a lot of different times on a lot of people and I'm not 100% convinced yet. I am excited though to try the other Fenty Beauty lipsticks that are coming, but I'm, I wasn't 100% convinced that I like needed that stunner personally, because I got Ruby Woo and I love her. Yeah, so you would have seen from this title, this is the last Self Love Saturday for a while because I am changing up my programming here on Andrea Lewis channel, um, on my YouTube channel, I'm changing up what I'm gonna be putting out. So don't be disappointed, don't be hurt, don't be sad because I'm still gonna be focused on content that I hope will motivate you and inspire you and still gonna be just putting in my life lessons in all of my content. But I'm changing up Self Love Saturday. I want to explore other people's stories. I want to hear from the people because I love Self Love Saturday, but I feel like I've given you guys so much of my own growth and lessons that at this time, it's like I wanna hear from other people who have different experiences than me, but have also gone through a journey of self love. So it's gonna be changing up. Eventually there will be Saturday content, but for now I'm gonna focus on the week. I have a new series coming called The Creative Process that will show you guys truly the best behind the scenes that I can give you of what it is like to be a full-time creative like myself, a producer and an actress and a content creator and all of the things that I do and what my hustle really looks like because I work hard. I don't know if you guys can tell but I be working hard, yo. And also I'm gonna be doing more beauty and lifestyle tips. I think I'm gonna be dropping that kind of stuff on a Tuesday because I realize I know a lot. I've I've done the work, I, I keep doing the work on just how to maintain um, your, your skin and your hair and just how to enhance and improve yourself and I'm on that journey like truly so I wanna share all of the things that I know with you guys, all the detoxes, all the face masks, all, all of that kind of stuff. So I think that's gonna be a Tuesday. Creative process is gonna be on a Friday and I'm gonna have scripted content coming. Woo -woo. I've got docs, I had a great year for talking to people, for connecting with um, people of color, black people, and hearing our stories. I did a documentary on black women and self-love. I'm working right now on a beauty documentary and learning the stories of all of these super successful beauty girls who are young and just creating a new lane for themselves, which is just so empowering and so amazing. And also, I did a documentary on black men that will eventually come out. I learned a lot doing this doc on, on just black men and hearing their stories and hearing the challenges that they have to face on a regular basis as a creative like a lot of progress in hearing other people's stories which which made me like grateful very very grateful and like I said so that made me say like when it comes to self-love Saturday that's where I want to focus it is like hearing people's stories I also worked with a lot of hair company brands this year and um, that is something that I'm not even gonna lie like I have shied away from over the years like when people will be like can you do beauty and all this stuff I'll be like I'm not a beauty blogger I am an actress who just happens to know how to do her hair and put on some makeup um, but I was glad to embrace that this year and I'm gonna embrace it more because I love beauty like that really is just a part of who I am as a woman and there's nothing wrong with like sharing my beauty life with you guys because that, that really is a part of myself. So I was really glad to work with a lot of different beauty companies this year. I hope to work with more next year and like bigger and better brand partnerships because uh, that's just like a part of something that I wanna continue to do. So that was very cool. So if you are not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe now. 
hit those notifications so that you know when my content is coming because I really want this channel to grow and I want you guys to see my true journey and I feel like sometimes I ignore that on this channel. I don't always share with you guys like the actual journey of being an actress and a writer and a producer and what that really looks like, how I've combined that with the digital space because I'm in kind of a lane of my own when it comes to that type of stuff. A lot of my meetings, that's just what they focus on is the fact that it's like not as many television and film actresses like myself who have that background take advantage of the digital space. And I've been working in the digital space since like 2009. So it's like, I'm like this weird halfway between being a TV actress and a YouTuber. And it's like an interesting space and I want to, I want to show you guys. Leave in the comments what your goals are for 2018. My goals for 2018 are to work heavily, heavily, heavily with my scripted work, produce like crazy, and to show you guys what that journey actually looks like. I've got a lot of great people that I'm adding to my team and I'm super excited about that. So I'm looking forward to 2018 on a whole. I hope you guys are too. There's new programming coming to this channel. Um, I have a new website coming. We're gonna have a new Jungle Wild logo. I have like all this new stuff happening. So I am excited. So I thank you guys for being on this journey. I hope you guys had a great 2017 and an awesome Christmas and holidays and Hanukkah and Kwanzaa and whatever you are celebrating at this time. I hope that you have the most amazing time you've ever had in your whole entire life. Um, and thank you guys for your continued support. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with any of your friends who you think need this message.